Good evening. Thank you so much for showing up for tonight. Thank you for those that are in person. Welcome to those that are watching our live stream. Uh, our concerts now we're able to live stream our performances. Thank you to the Edison Activities Council for purchasing that equipment so we're able to do so. So we're really excited for our performance tonight. Thank you guys for coming here. Tonight we're featuring three of our performing ensembles here at Edison. We have multiple performing ensembles. This is night two of our uh, performances. We're featuring our beginning band, which is in front of you here um, up on stage. We're featuring our rock band. And then we're also featuring our advanced drum line tonight. So thank you so much. Uh, just a few housekeeping things, and then we'll get started. Just a reminder that when you are here in the auditorium, please don't um, consume anything, both for COVID-related purposes as well as just to keep things nice and clean. Um, if you would, please go ahead and silence your cell phones. Um, unless you are an EMT or emergency personnel, we understand that. Um, again, in this space, Minneapolis Public Schools requires masks when we're in the space for those that are two and older. Please, just a reminder, um, have that over both your mouth and your nose. You should have received on your program, there was a little QR code. Um, that is for an opportunity for you to fill out a quick little Google form for contact tracing purposes. Um, so if you're able to sometime during the night, take care of that or on your way out, that would be great. Thank you so much for doing that ahead of time. All right. And I'm gonna go ahead and read a land acknowledgement. This is something um, that we're doing in Minneapolis Public Schools, um, just to acknowledge um, where we are in this space. Buildings that make up the Minneapolis Public Schools community are built within the traditional homelands of the Dakota people. Minnesota comes from the Dakota name for this region, Minnesota Makoche, known now as Minnesota translate to the land where the waters reflect the skies or cloudy waters. Edison High School recognizes the original peoples of this place and are committed to making ongoing efforts to educate the community about the relationship that Dakota people have to this area, both historically and today as they remain here in their home. All right, thank you again for coming to our show. We're gonna start with the beginning band. At Edison High School, we have a really cool opportunity for our students to take multiple music classes, both beginning level and advanced. So you're gonna see a little bit of, of all of that tonight. Um, so beginning band, these are students that either it's been a little bit since they played a musical instrument or they've never played a musical instrument before. And they picked an instrument, we tried them out, and we decided which ones, that number one that they liked, that they would wanna learn, and then we'll also what kind of fit them in their personality. And so since September, we've been working on these instruments, learning how to read music, learning how to manipulate an instrument, also manipulate an embouchure, manipulate sticks, play with different pieces of equipment. So they've done a lot in just about two and a half months. So we're really excited to be able to show that for you. That was Hot Cross Buns. That's just a snippet of what they were like when they first started. So really simple tune, um, but working on playing together as well as understanding their instrument. The next song we have for you is... Oh, thank you. Bingo. This is my kids, one of my kids' favorite songs.
So not only do they learn how to play their instrument and learn how to keep time and counting, they also learn different concepts, so things like rests, so silence versus sound. Uh, and that piece of music, you heard what we call pickup notes. If you want to know the musical term, it's called an anacrusis. You never know, crossword puzzle, Jeopardy sometime. Um, and so they learn all these other techniques that go with reading music. The next piece we're going to do for you is jingle bells. And with that piece, you're going to see the percussionists move to different pieces of equipment. Um, so not only do percussionists just do bells or mallet percussion, they also do drums and also auxiliary, which you're going to see tonight. We also learn to have different parts and play it together as a full group. So we're not all playing the same melody or the, all the same part. Now we're learning how to learn our own part, play our own part, while also some, something else going on, whether it's a harmony or an accompaniment or something like that. So we're going to showcase that for you now. Here's Jingle Bells. Plus, it helps it's a song that most of them recognize. Um, so our last piece for beginning band, I can believe it went that fast, is um, we, the, uh, the first three pieces that we performed tonight were actually out of a, what we call a method book, which is kind of like a textbook, but for musicians. And so those first three pieces were out of that. Now we're ch transitioning to something called sheet music. And with that comes um, various parts. That means that when you look at the piece of music, you don't see anyone's part but your own, so you really have to pay attention to what's going on, understanding your part, as well as putting it together with others. Uh, plus, you get to do some fun songs. So we're going to end our segment here for Beginning Band with a piece called Android Attack.
One more round of applause for our beginning band, please. All right, coming to the stage now, we have our Edison Rock Band. Rock Band is actually a club that we host through our Beacons After School program. If you don't know what Beacons is, it's a really cool program that is connected with, uh, I think it's the YWCA. And um, with that, they offer students different af after school activities. So things like cooking classes. Um, there's a really cool opportunity called Beats and Rhymes. Um, there's culture clubs. There's a whole bunch of different things involved um, for our students. And one of the things that we offer is rock band. So we meet after school uh, once a week on Wednesdays. Everyone is welcome to come and join, whether you know how to play an instrument or not, we will teach you. And it also gives students an opportunity to perform in a different genre of music that we might not necessarily tackle during the school day. Um, so this is a student-led group. Uh, they pick the songs, they learn the parts, um, and tonight they're putting together a show for you. So um, I'm just gonna get off the stage and let them do their thing. Ladies and gentlemen, Edison High School Rock Band.
Give it up one more time for your Edison High School Rock Band. Pull that back. Cool. One of the fun things about having all these different ensembles is moving all this cool stuff on stage. A lot of which is purchased by donations from you, FYI, so thank you so much in advance. Last for you tonight, we have our Edison High School Advanced Drum Line. Here at Edison High School, we actually have three drum lines. We have two beginning drum lines, which were featured on our first concert on Thursday. And then we also have our Advanced Drum Line tonight. Uh, advanced Drum Line members are those that have been in drum line for a year, or they've been also in other ensembles for at least a year, um, so they can come and um, perform with us. We do a little bit more advanced techniques, sticking techniques. Um, we're one of the probably most sought after organizations or groups to play in our community, which is really cool. Um, yeah, and they're great. So that, that always makes life a lot easier. You guys good? Cool, I need to get suited up so I gotta go grab something while we're back. You guys ready? Oh, cool. Yep, I wanna grab it. This is your Edison High School Advanced Drum Line.
give it up one more time for your Edison High School Advanced Drumline. Did you guys have a good time tonight? Oh, come on. Did you have a good time tonight? There we go. Thank you guys so much for coming out tonight um, and attending our concert and supporting our students and our community. Um, we at Edison High School, um, we kind of rely on the support of our community members and um, we're so grateful for everything that you guys showing up, whether it's on the live stream or in person. Um, we have Taryn, who is a clarinet in our beginning band, who's gonna be out front uh, with a really big pickle jar. And if you have pennies, change, dollars, check, um, we would love to have any kind of donation. We wanna keep our concerts free at Edison. And it also helps support our, our program to get things like music, reeds, creams, oils, greases, sticks, new drum heads, things like that. So make sure our students have a good experience while they're in our ensembles. Thank you again so much for coming out tonight. Um, also, if you want to, uh, feel free to text Edison to 44321. That is also an online donation form with our Edison and Activities Council, which we're grateful for, for doing the live stream tonight. Thank you again, guys, for coming out. We really appreciate it. Have a wonderful night and a great new year.